Hi guys! So, dumating na yung um, package natin from Smart. Actually, medyo mabilis siya nang dumating. Eh. Kasi, tumawag ako last um, last Thursday. And today is Monday. So, sabi kasi nila expect the delivery within 7 to 10 days. So, pero 2 days pa lang. Kasi wala naman silang weekend. So, Friday and then today dumating na. So, wow. I'm super excited. So, nag-renew ako ng smart. Kasi nasira yung isa kong phone. So, tumawag ako ng Thursday. And, um, puti nga may delivery. Kasi, grabe ang hirap lockdown. Tapos, wala kang phone. So, wala kang, um, walang mapagdilibangan. So, thank you smart for, 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 the quick delivery, grande, sobrang di ko expect So, today, gagawa tayo na unboxing. Yeah, fresh na fresh pa siya. Sealed, and wow. As in, wow. So, open na natin. Wait lang. Yay! Open na natin. So, yan. S20. Samsung S20. I've been using Samsung for like 10 years or so. Or more. So, yan. So, yeah. Cosmic Grey. Ayaw niyang mag-focus. Anyway. Yan. Yeah, um, Cosmic Grey. And 1 to 8 GB. And ito yung parts. I don't know. Hindi ko tayo na mag-focus. So, anyway. Let's open it. Ayan. So, nandito yung SIM card eject tool. So, meron siya. Ah! Thank you. Kasi lockdown. So, wala akong mabibiling um, case ngayon. So, thank you. Kasi meron free jelly case. Yeah. Transparent. And then, the manual. Quick start guide and warranty card. So, wala na. And this is the phone. This is, yes, gray. So, so, ayan. Meron siyang plastic. Ayan, meron siyang plastic sa likod. And then, meron siyang malipis na here. So, ang SIM card tray niya ay nandito sa top. Ayan. Ito pala. And then, yung power button and volume up and down. And USB Type-C. So, wala na tayo ngayon um, headphone insert kasi dito na din siya. I guess. So, tingnan natin yung laman. So, we have the outlet. Yeah. It says here, supercharging. And then, USB-C din. Hindi siya USB. Type C. Super fast. Super fast charging. And then, walang laman. This is the cable. Yan. So, type C na sila pareho. Time sina for the socket, for the plug in, and for the phone. Hmm. And then, ito yung 
earphones. So we have the AKG. And then we have a different sizes for the earplugs here. And then meron na rin siya dito. So, okay naman din yung... Ito rin naman yung ginagamit ko before. So, okay naman siya. Hindi naman siya basag. So, quality of voice is okay, smooth. And then, so, ayan kung maliit yung yung butas ng tenga nyo or malaki. So, pwede nyo siyang palitan. Interchangeable. So, thank you. And, yun, black lahat siya. So, uh, natin siya. This is the camera. Let's wait. Shampoo is smart. So, wala na siyang fingerprint dito sa, sa likod. Hmm. Ay, smart. Puto tayo sa... Actually, okay naman yung ano niya, oh. Swipe up and down. Medyo mabilis. Na, mabilis naman talaga siya. It's very accurate. And, um, let's see. Settings. Biometrics and security. Add your fingerprint. A quick and easy way to unlock your phone and verify yourself in apps. Your fingerprint, your fingerprint data is secured by Knox. So continue. Before you can register your fingerprints, you need to set secure lock. Let's see. Remember this pattern. If you forget it, you need to reset your phone and all data will be saved. Continue. Will be erased pala. Draw again. I cancel. Again. Medyo sensitive siya guys. So, do it slowly. Confirm. So, note about the screen covers and protect protectors. Make sure you, that you don't use the screen cover while registering your fingers. If you use a screen protector, make sure it allows for you, it allows for use of the ultrasonic fingerprint sensor. Okay. So, ito, dito guys, yung fingerprint area niya. Press a little harder. Place your fingers on the sensor, then lift it when it's off. When you feel the vibration. So, make sure na madaanan nung scanner yung buong fingers para any position ng pag-unlock nyo ng phone, mara-register. Get the full scan. Reposition your finger each time you capture the edges of your fingerprint. Continue. There you go. 
done. Back up your pattern. Remote unlock will be turned on if find my mobile and your pin pattern or password will be securely stored by Samsung. So, okay. So, let's see. Bilis, di ba? Kaya lang medyo tricky yung yung place. Kasi since hindi mo alam, hindi mo makikita kung saan mo siya ilalagay talaga. So, you have to memorize it na lang. So, it's like an inch below sa, sa pinaka mababa, sa pinaka dulo, pinaka ba ng phone. There you go. So, that's it. So, yung camera natin is 12 megapixel. Yung isa. Meron tayong wide. And then, uh, meron tayong telephoto. I guess this this is the, this one is the telephoto. Eh. So, meron tayong 3 times hybrid optical zoom. Meron tayong 12 megapixel. 13 millimeter ultra wide. And super steady video. So, gawa natin ng um, gawa natin ng review yung ating um, images and videos later. So, sabi um, ang, ang Samsung is uh, meron tayong LED flash and auto HDR and panorama. Yung selfie camera natin is 10 megapixel 26 mm wide and um Dual video call. Hmm, I'm not sure of that yet. Try natin yan later. And then, yes, meron tayong um, speakers. Ayan, meron tayong speakers. And then, Wi-Fi, dual band, Wi-Fi direct hotspot. Uh, Bluetooth natin is 5.0. Uh, meron tayong GPS. And um, FM radio, Snapdragon model only. So, USB type 3.2 type C, 1.0 reversible connector, USB on the go. So, you're done. So, yung colors natin, ang kinuha ko is cosmic gray. Meron siyang available colors na cosmic gray, cloud blue, cloud pink, cloud white, and aura red. So, syempre, um, nung tumawag kasi akong available na lang is blue, uh, cloud blue, cloud pink, and cosmic gray. So, since hindi naman ako yung girly type, ang kinuha ko na lang is cosmic gray. So, well, kahit, kahit naman anong color eh, kung lalagyan mo naman din siya ng other housing aside from, from dito sa free natin. So, any color naman pwede natin ilagay. So, um, Let's check nga yung ating audio kung, kung maganda. Ano wala pa pala? Uh, hmm. Biometrics, advanced features. So, wala pa yata silang pre-installed na... Ah, waiting na natin sa ringtones. Hmm. Nalilito ako dito ah. Nasaan yung files? Ayan. Um, audio natin dito. Maganda pa rin, hindi pa rin siya masag. Malinaw pa rin siya. 
just like the other um, S series Samsung, very very nice pa din. Very uh, malinis, malinis yung yung audio niya. Yan. Guys, check natin yung um, settings sa so, display. So, meron tayong day mode, daylight, meron light mode, and dark mode. So, for me, para sa akin, ha, uh, mas matipid sa battery if naka dark mode. Tsaka, parang mas less yung uh, pag-overheat niya. Kasi, mas less yung light na nagagamit. Unlike pag dito. So, customize ko naman. Kung gusto nyo, kung malabo mata nyo, pwede kayong sa light mode. Ako kasi mas prefer ko talaga yung dark mode. Lalo na pag gabi. Kasi pag uh, masyadong bright yung phone, sumasakit yung mata ko. So, yung brightness natin, ganyan. Sa dulo. Um, very, ano siya, responsive sa sa hands. Sa, sa clicker. And then, let's see. Uh, navigation bar. So, pwede tayong mag ganito, yung um, the usual. Yung merong um, home button and then yung back button. Pero, let's try yung ganito. And then, kapag naka ganito kayo, pwede kayong pwede nyo siyang i-customize kung saan yung back button nyo kung gusto nyo sa left side. Kung left-handed kayo or right-handed. So, um, either way, kung saan nyo mas feel. Yan siya. So, right now, mas eto try natin so pag back button hit lang siya sa ayun ya ayun pala dapat sa dulo so yun so there you go pag may natutunan pa ako guys let's upload din sorry guys di ako masyado nang uh, magaling magtanggal ng ganyan so let's see I-off muna natin siya. Hey. Saan yung power button dito? Bixby button pala siya. Paano natin siya mapatayin? Wait, dali dito ako. So, wala siya lang. Wala siyang off button. Tama na. Anyway, let's check na lang muna yung um, SIM card tray. So, there. There's SIM. Ah. So, there's SIM 1, SIM 2, hybrid yung SIM 2 natin. So, pwede natin siya lagyan ng um, memory card and um, nano SIM card. So, micro SD and nano SIM card. 